we have to find the value of this expression. What we have here, 4 in first parenthesis, 4 times 10 to fifth power. Next, plus 3 times 10 to third power and 5 times 10 to first power. We have powers of 10. We have to do multiplication 4 times 10 to fifth. When we have power of 10, the power tell us how many zeros we have to write. So we copy always the number. We have 4 in this example. And now we just write how many zeros we have here. 5. Because the power of 10 is 5. So we have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 zeros. And we have plus. Again, we copy 3. And we, again, we have times 10 to third power, power of 10. So we have to write how many zeros? 3. Because we have 10 to third power. 1, 2, 3 power. So we have 3,000. 3 times 10 to third power is 3,000. Plus, we copy 5. And now we have 10 to first power. Power is 1. So we have to write just one zero. We have 5 times 10 to first power is 10. 5 times 10 is 50. And now we have to add these three numbers. If you don't know how to do this, you can always add comma. We just count from left three digits. 1, 2, 3, and we write comma. 1, 2, 3, and we write comma. So we have 400,000 plus 3,000 plus 50. So this is 400, 3,000, 50. Or you can write this 400,000 plus we have 3,000 plus 50. So we start from the left side, we just add last column. So 0 plus 0 plus 0 is 0, 0 plus 0 plus 5 is 5, 0 plus 0, and we have empty space, so this is 0, so we have 0, we copy comma, 0 plus 3 is 3, 0, and we don't have any digits so we have only zero and four empty space so we have only four so we got the same four hundred three thousand fifty this is my solution